Okay, now we're going to prepare to drop the rear trailer off the dolly. Let's turn the air off. You'll hear the air shut down, but that doesn't mean all of the air is out of the system. You want to take the bottom glad hand off first, just in case there's still a charge. It won't blow in your eye. Same thing with the top glad hands, turn your face away, just in case there's a little more air left in the trailer. Like that. Snap your glad hands together to keep moisture out of the system, put everything in the basket. Now when we pull the fifth wheel, your stance is the same as all of our other safe work methods. Shoulder width apart, one foot slightly ahead of the other. One hand on the trailer, the other hand on the handle. If it doesn't come out that easy, don't fight it. It always wins. Get back in the tractor, back up just a little bit to put pressure on the fifth wheel and take the pressure off the pin, and it'll come out like butter. Now when we're dropping a trailer off the dolly, it's a little different than the tractor. All the dolly fifth wheels are the same height. So we crank down to the ground, no pressure. Just touch the ground and you're done. This way, when the dolly comes out from underneath the load, the fifth wheel is going to raise up a little bit because it's mounted on springs. And the trailer won't be too high or too low for the next tractor or dolly.